Denande tak denande tek Hirum and Tala Sedulu Hail Sabrim and trapped in the dark Hail Sabrim and drift on thy bark Dark Lords banish thy reign is nigh My time to bring the orb My undead lords within the core, your name I hail, enfold the orb! What the heck? Donande tak, donande tek, a room menta la sed. Damn. Hun? You want bacon? You know I do. Damn TV. Lousy second rate candle makers, kill them all when I rule the world. What sort of half baked operation do they think I'm running here? <laughs> Now where was it? Dananda tat, dananda tat, da da da. Yeah. Oh yeah. I call upon the power of one dark name, one black heart, one grievous soul. I call upon the power of Primor of Santissima. What the? At last, the power of the orb is mine, and with it the souls of the dead. Soon I shall rule triumphant over all of Nox! <laughs> Blazes! What manner of demon spawn dares attack my ship? Off you, mutant imp, or you'll have no head to put a hat on! Wait, please! I need your help! I don't know what's happened, or where I am, or... What is this place? No place at all, except the clouds. But off the noble Julian you go, under your power, or by the lift of my boot. Ah! Hold on, what's this? It's my TV. Hmm, and what does this TV do? Do? Uh, it doesn't really do anything. You just watch it. See, here's where you plug it in, and this knob changes the channels. I think it's broken. Intoxicating. The look of it promises a host of mysteries. You should see it when it's on. Give me the glass box, Imp, and I'll spare you your deadly plummeting fate. Why do you keep calling me Imp? My name is Jack. Granted, you've no wings, but you fly like an Imp. I can't fly. I fell. I fell here from my living room. Fell from what? No matter. It's either overboard with gravity as your guide, or I take the TV as fair for safe passage. <laughs> Deal? Can you take me home? Tina made bacon tonight. Bacon bound we go, Imp. But first, I need your help with something. When following your destiny's particular path, the way of the conjurer, a discreet and undetected arrival is more often the best policy, lad. Here, at the abandoned manor mines, you'll find a tunnel which takes you into the very heart of the village of Ix. Once there, you must find the master conjurer of Ix, Aldwyn. I'll bring you no further, lad. Too many prying eyes the closer we get by air to the village of Ix. Follow the tunnel which leads to Ix. Find my old friend, Aldwyn. He'll help you if he can. Take this staff. Forest beasts will heed its bite should they threaten. Careful as you go, lad. Go! Don't just stand there. Get a move on.
Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. Welcome to Ix, stranger. If you're here for the mayor's archery contest, go on in. A fine tavern is straight ahead. An excellent respite after so long a journey. What is your goal, do you remember? Aldwin is your goal. You cannot undertake your sacred conjurer studies without him. 
find Alwyn in a village of conjurers might require getting to know the village better, so it knows you, so to speak, eh? Your gold is always welcome here. Citizens of Nyx, I come bearing gifts for the future subjects of my queen, Hakuba. No doubt you're here for the archery contest. I've got a real nice bow for sale. Since I like your face, I'll let it go for 100 gold. Are you interested? There you go. That bow was made for you. You can't lose the contest with a bow like that. saw a huge spider crawl toward the mayor's house. Hope he's all right. He's definitely afraid of spiders. It's a disaster. Spiders are Mayor Theogren's greatest fear, and a swarm has nested in his study. He's locked himself away and won't come out till the spiders are gone. A conjurer named Olwyn lives outside of town to the east. We need him to charm the spiders and liberate our besieged mayor. Stop. Stop. Feel free to look around. I'm here if you need anything. of him, something of a hermit. Go on the path east out of town across the bridge. You'll find it. Sorry, I don't talk to under <laughs> Charming wolves, huh? Greetings. My name is Henrik. I charm and tame the local wolves to keep the countryside safe for travelers. The mayor is still locked away in his home. 
How a man can be that frightened by a little spider is beyond me. Sorry, mate. The bridge is washed out. Only way across the stream is there, through the urchin den. But if you choose that route, mate, keep your guard up. The urchin stole my best boots when I was bathing. If you bring them back, mate, I'll teach you a damn fine spell.
boots. I never thought I'd see him again. I'm eternally grateful, mate. Here's the spell, as promised. Greetings. My name is Henrik. Huh? Did you see where the necromancer went? He couldn't have just vanished. That necromancer just vanished before my very eyes. Are you entering the archery contest? If so, you'll need your own bow and an entrance fee of 20 in gold. We provide the arrows. Well, do I enter you or not? All right, everything looks in order. Go on in. The official will explain the rules. Good luck. Huh? I'm today's contest judge. Today's best score is 8 out of 10 hits on the target. You need at least 9 to win. Each entrant gets a quiver with 20 arrows. This one is yours. Take it to the firing line when you're ready. Ready, set, begin! Congratulations to our new champion archer. Your prize is 50 gold pieces. You've already competed here. <clears throat> Sorry, the rules disallow re-entrance. Huh? It's a disaster. Spiders are Mayor Theogrin's greatest fear. What's the good word? Huh? The mayor is kind and gentle, but his outbreaks are becoming a nuisance for the whole town. Huh? Sorry, I don't talk to underlings. Oh. Huh? Spiders have infested the mayor's house. Stranger, let's get to know each other. Buy something.
you're welcome to X. Stay out of trouble, and you won't ever have to see the inside of one of these cells. That necromancer just vanished before my very eyes. Sorry, you can't leave without Mayor Theogren's permission. It's meant for your own good. The wilds hold far too many perils for the common man. The mayor is still locked away in his home. Greetings. I am Master Conjurer Alwyn, and you are sent by the captain, eh? Well, there is indeed room for one more apprentice, but you must pay thirty in gold for your charm creature spell. Do you accept my offer? Very well. This book has a spell to charm creatures. The scroll is a field guide to spiders, which allows you to charm them. You must stay nearby when charming a creature. If you move too far away before the charm has set, it will break the spell. Once a creature is charmed, you may banish it from this world, or make it obey your commands. Take the elevator down to the cellar, then find a tunnel which leads directly to the magic shop in town. You will encounter scores of spiders down there. Practice your new spell on them. I must return to my studies. Something is strangely amiss in our land, and I must learn its cause. Ha <laughs> ha 
We use only the best ingredients for our wares, which come from the furthest corners of the land. Thank goodness. A conjurer. Oh, go on inside. The mayor is still held up in his chambers. Finally, a conjurer has come to my aid. Did it? They're gone? Really gone? I'll be right out. <clears throat> huh? 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 Brave conjurer, my deepest thanks. You are worthy of your new title. The guards will be informed that you are now free to come and go from Ix as you please. Take this gold as payment for your service. I insist. This is the home of Mayor Theogrim. Wild beasts have invaded the manor mines, threatening many workers. One from our ranks must go, take charge and tame these abominable creatures. Huh? The mayor has given permission for your departure. You may pass, conjurer. I have an uneasy feeling about the timing of this violence at the Manor Mines, lad. Brutal attacks against our miners by strange creatures, immediately halting production just when we got it up and running again. Our hour of need is nigh. Drive out the creatures, lad. Save the captured miners and get back here in one piece. All, but I know you're not one of those infernal bandits who stole my spectacles. I'm almost blind without them. If you could get them back, you'd save my life, and I'd be eternally grateful. <sighs> Have you recovered my spectacles? Jump. Jump. 
You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices. Gold is always welcome here. Welcome to our hallowed shop. We offer goods for the full range of a conjurer's needs. Welcome to our hallowed shop. We offer goods for the full range of a conjurer's needs. down the path. The foreman is waiting for you outside the miner's lodge. He'll direct you from there. to get here, we have a horrible problem. 
horrific overgrown insects and airborne demons from the underworld have overrun the mines. Mine workers have died in defense of Noctis' vital interests. Please, we beg you, clear the beasts from the mines, rescue my miners, and I shall reward you handsomely. This key will unlock the door to the first trap mine worker. He will help you find the others. I also have a beast scroll which should be quite useful. Five workers are trapped in the mines below us. If we hurry, we may be able to save all of them. Follow me. I can guard and operate the elevators while you search for the workers. Take this key and use it to release the first worker. He'll have another key to give you when you free him. Let's go. Follow me. Over here! I'll wait here! Thank you for freeing me. Please help me back to the elevator. I used this key to lock myself in here. Take it. You need it to release another trapped worker. Much better now. Come 
Thank you for freeing me. Please help me back to the elevator. I used this key to lock myself in here. Take it. You need it to release another trapped worker. Elevator.
That was too close. Excellent. I'll start the elevator now. Take this key. It's for the locked doors down below. There you go. Thank you for finding me. Please take me back to the elevator. Yeah. 
Go see the foreman. I'm sure he has a fine reward for your efforts. Truly a hero. My deepest thanks. Uh, while you were in the mine saving my men, the captain came by looking for you. He's waiting for you at the crossroads east of here. Before you go, please take this gold as a reward. Your valor knows no peer. We all thank you for saving our men. with the miners, lad. With the mana supply re-established, the wizards of Galava will be busy tonight. But if I know Hecuba, I fear rumors of her practicing the forbidden black arts may be true. And it is up to us to journey to the Field of Valor, where you must find out for sure if she is communing with the undead through her ancestors' occult art of necromancy. Gather whatever supplies you need from these merchants and return to me when you are ready to leave. Welcome to our hallowed shop. We offer goods for the full range of a conjurer's needs. Welcome to our hallowed shop. We offer goods for the full range of a country. Your gold is always welcome here. New here, aren't you? Your money is still good with me. You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices. Decades ago on this sacred plain, armies from the north and south met in a deadly contest to decide the fate of Nox. And those that fell remain here in the Tomb of Valor. And here too on this killing field, 
a young leader, the hero Jandor, tired of mayhem and death, drew the line at the life of a young infant. The baby girl's name was Hecuba, the sole bearer of the Northern Mage's cursed blood legacy. Jandor let her live on among the ogres. Years later she disappeared, but Hecuba may be here now, lad, attempting to raise the dead, to fill the ranks of her unholy armies from the tombs below. She must be stopped. The entrance to the tombs is in the building at the end of the path. See if Hecuba's been here. You'll know. And careful, many of the crypts have traps against grave robbers. Enter the Tomb of Valor, lad. We must know if reports of Hecuba's acts are true. Hurry, go into the crypts to see if Hecuba has already been here. I have a feeling we could be excellent friends. That is, if you are willing to be my best customer.
Dude, uh. I am your one and only master. What? Hey, you fools! Obey me! Obey me! Damn! Akiba, beware. Human eyes are upon us. What strange sorcery allows a human to be here undetected? To steal my orb? Never! You shall die in this tomb, then join the ranks of my invincible undead legions! It will be your honor to serve, Hecuba human. But first, you need to die. Oh. Hey, Joe. Joe. Oh, you may 
have stopped me. But you'll never leave this crypt alive.
Yeah, John. John. Trials in the Tomb of Valor have tested your metal well, lad. But no time to rest on laurels. You must now recover the Amulet of Teleportation, which the Ogres took from Horvath when they raided the unlucky hamlet of Bryn. With the Ogres on the move, and with this as their prize, Hecuba is most certainly behind it all.
Horvath is waiting in the village. Now, off with you. Greetings, Adept. I am thankful you are here at last, for we are in dire need of your help. The ogre forces overran Bryn a short time ago and robbed me of the amulet of teleportation. Please go to the ogre village in the northeast and retrieve the precious artifact as soon as possible. Greetings, Wanderer. A friendly warning if you are traveling north. We have been stationed here to guard against ogre attacks. A large band of these foul creatures just laid waste to the poor village of Bryn north of here. have destroyed everything. Maybe we shouldn't have built so close to the Ogre Village. Dude, uh, greetings, brave adventurer. Please help me. A horrific fate has befallen my wife. Not long ago, a raving demoness led the ogres through here. She cast an evil spell, turning my poor wife into a wolf. I could reverse this curse if I only had my magic staff, but I left it in my house northwest of here. I'm afraid if I leave to go retrieve it, my wife will run off. Would you help me, my friend? 
fetching my staff will be kind, sir. I will offer a worthy reward for its timely return. Greetings, brave adventurers. have more important things to be doing? You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices. You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices. Ugh! <laughs> 
thank you so much, brave and kind adventurer. I can never hope to repay you fully for your service, but please take this as a token of our appreciation. The curse is broken! The curse has been broken! I'm free! Many thanks to you, one. Huh? Good luck on your journey, kind. You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices.
do uh. right. Yeah. 
Jesus. Do rock. Do rock. Come <laughs> on. 
Congratulations, brave apprentice. Oh, many thanks for your aid in rescuing the amulet. With its return, we will finally be able to thwart that foul demoness's plans once and for all. Here, these bottles of mana and the infravision spell will come in handy. Sooner than you think. I know now that I can entrust you with my true name, Jandor. Yes, I was the one who led those brave sons of Nox onto the field of valor. All those who now may have died in vain, unless we can stop her. One last hope for Nox remains, the Staff of Oblivion. Long ago, because of the Staff's awesome might, it was disassembled and taken to different parts of Nox. So now, the first part you must get is the Halberd of Horrendous. You need to enter Dune Mir and ask for an audience with Horrendous, and petition to be given his prized Halberd. Go! Don't just stand there! Get a move on! Horrendous was right. Magic is evil. Those foul wizards are to blame. Safeguard horrendous. Hecuba must not get his helmet. Our goods are guaranteed to work under all circumstances.
Most last line of defense is at the fortress. If the fortress falls, Knox falls. Onward! to the fortress.
I am in complete control of the situation. I shall take the field wherever Hecuba pleases. It does not matter where. But then I shall throw down the challenge of single combat, which no one may refuse. Once I alone face her, she shall understand the true meaning of warlord. Horrendous! Your fire knights are toads. Your cause is mud, and your worth is dirt. Give me your halberd, and I'll let you and your little sheep live for now. Resist, and I will level all Dunmere. Hecuba, your brazen assault on Dunmere's inner sanctum has only saved me the trouble of finding you and ending your evil reign before it begins. I challenge you to single combat, Hecuba. You may not refuse my challenge, or your minions will see the cowardice of your rule, and your authority will vanish like dust in the wind. <laughs> Why, thank you, horrendous. I'd love to dance with you. I thought you'd never ask. Mind if I lead? <laughs> oh, death and victory, the sweetest brew. My necromancer's blood sings in my veins with an unholy joy. The doorway to all locks is open to me. I shall rule supreme. Oh, may Saint Grendel have mercy on my soul. This bitter defeat was not supposed to happen. The sands of my hourglass are quickly running out, lad. Retrieve the old warlord's staff and take it from here to the place I instructed you, and do it now. A fallen warlord, how quaint. One of my favorite sights. You shall not be needing this any more, and we have much more use for it than you ever did. I'll take your halberd now. <laughs> Thank you, horrendous. No, no, please. Don't get up. <laughs> your pathetic life hangs in a precarious balance, odd mortal. If you wish to stay alive, stay away. And this is your only warning. Let no one follow, or the bite of this halberd will be the least of your worries. I take no prisoners. Hubris, pride, arrogance, call it what you will the cause of my downfall. But dwelling on my fate is now moot. You must recover my halberd before the necromancer leaves Dunmere, or all is lost. Use the halberd, complete the incorporation with the staff of oblivion, and defeat Hecuba. Oh, I fear I am done, lad. <laughs> of this folly will be your gravestone.
we may be too late already. Hecuba's forces are attacking the wizard tower. Galliver's fate is very cloudy. You must make your way there, to the tower, find Horvath, and get the next part of the Staff of Oblivion, the Heart of Nox. Once incorporated with the Halberd of Horrendous, its magical force powers a shock capable of killing a demon with the slightest touch. Go, bring the Heart of Nox. If it falls into Hecuba's hands, all is lost. Here we are, lad, in Yalaba. The heart of Nox is located in the topmost floor of the Tower of Illusion. Hecuba's ogres have already overrun the lower portions of the tower. Guildmaster Horvath has not been heard from since the invasion began. You'll be on your own. Once you retrieve the heart of Nox, get back here as quickly as you can. Good luck. The road to Ix is closed. The ogres are marching to destroy us. The smart people have already left Galava. If you're smart, you'll leave Galava too. Is it true what they say about conjurers? <laughs> Trouble's brewing, lad. I can't believe the wizards lost control of their tower. Bad tidings, indeed. Better stop while you can. Actually, business has fallen off quite a bit with Hecuba running loose. I'm moving out of here to set up shop further south. I love that door. Smuggled in from the vast fortunes of Doom Moon. Haven't seen many conjurers lately. Galava isn't exactly a vacation spot right now, what with ogres running rampant in the tower.
Mushrooms can cure poison, but they can also do nasty things to your mind. Watch out for ember demons. Their fireballs are lethal. Haven't seen many conjurers lately. Galava isn't exactly a vacation spot right now. No matter if Hecuba's ogre minions break into our town, these grounds are safe haven. Even ogres wouldn't violate the sanctity of St. Alistair's church. Hmm. I thought I locked that door. Welcome, Conjurer. I hope you can toss a few ogre bodies my way. I wouldn't mind burying a few of them myself. Those ogres invading the tower won't have a chance against my weapons. I've got the finest assortment of arms in the south. Hello, Conjurer. I'm just about ready to pick up and move out. Everything's on sale, if you're interested. Planning to help out my colleagues in the tower, eh? You're going to need magical help, lad. I'm willing to lower my prices if you think you can reclaim our tower for us.
mischievous undead army is coming to take the heart of Knox. Let him take it, I say. One minute the tower was clear, and the next it was flooded with ogres and demons. They want the heart of Knox. Do that! Ah. 
Nice job. job.
you. Uh. Please help us.
Begone, witch. The heart of Dox is beyond your reach. You do not want to face me in combat. You can't stop me, Horvath. I have the power to destroy you now, worthless old fossil. My life may be ending, but you still don't have what you seek, foul witch. There is another more powerful than me who now stands in your way. Shall meet again, and next time you will not have more vast lackeys to protect you. It is truly a tragic day for Galava and the Southern Lands. With Horvath gone, Hecuba will now have greater freedom to create deadly havoc. You must quickly retrieve the heart of Nox for the staff. Good luck, Conjurer. The third component of the staff is the Weirdling Beast. You must go to the Temple of Ix and seek it. Being trained as a conjurer here in Ix should aid you, but keep your guard up and return with the Weirdling on the Halberd and only on the Halberd of Horrendous. Its touch on any other metal ends in utter destruction. Return from the Temple of Ix with the Weirdling Beast so we may complete the Staff of Oblivion. This is as close as I can bring you. The Temple of Ix lies north of the village. You must make your way quickly, but you may need the help of Alwyn to get there. Retrieve the weirdling beast and meet me back here in this clearing. Move smartly, lad!
Ninja Hunt. Hunt. Best of luck on your quest, young adventurer. Welcome home, young conjurer. Old one is looking for you. Other. Buy something! Gold is always welcome here. Thank you. 
don't get many visitors around here. This is the home of Mayor Theogrip. So, now you have both the Halberd of Horrendous and our Heart of Nox. Well done, young conjurer. Wrong man, sorry. With the Halberd of Horrendous and Heart of Nox Incorporated, the staff is now prepared to convey the weirdling beast. The beast is housed in the Temple of Ix, guarded by the Conjurers and kept by the Sacred Order of Oblivion. You must go to the Temple and speak to the priests. Here is the key to unlock the gate which blocks passage to the Temple.
We have been expecting your arrival. The Sacred Order of Oblivion are the caretakers and devout guardians of the Weirdling. Once you reach the Weirdling, the beast will cling to the staff, since the heart of Nox contains the richest source of energy it requires, much more than the meager offerings in the pools. The Weirdling thrives on pure energy, which it receives from the Zon pools in the remote depths of our subterranean temple. With the energy provided by the staff, the Weirdling beast can channel the very forces of life itself. It is a weapon without peer, and will even channel a bit of your adversary's life into your own. It is time to resume your quest, lad. Hecuba grows more powerful with each passing minute. Time to resume your quest, lad.
Dude, in dude. Hunt.
There is a mysterious sorceress, Hecuba, roaming the southern lands. She's said to be in possession of a magical object of great power. This is the home of Mayor Theo. Huh? Gather whatever supplies you need from these merchants and return to me when you are ready to leave. Welcome. New here, aren't you? Your money is still good with me. Perhaps you could use a scroll or potion? Gold is always welcome here. Perhaps you could use a scroll or potion? Attacking Hecuba in her stronghold in the land of the dead is what she expects least. Yet getting there through the dismal swamp holds a host of challenges in itself. Find Aldwin's conjurer brother Mordwin in the swamp. He'll help you with supplies. Reach the far side of the swamp and beware of the ogre outpost. Find the nomad trading post outside the gates to the land of the dead. Do that lad, and you'll be in a prime position to attack Hecuba from her blind side. Here we are, lad, the dismal swamp. This is as far as I can safely take you. A short way up this path you'll find the home of Mordwin, brother of Aldwin the Conjurer. He's expecting you. I must hurry, and so should you. You remain our only hope. <laughs> Ra! 
I have a feeling we could be excellent friends. That is, if you are willing to be my best customer. We could be excellent friends. That is, if you are willing to be my best customer.
Prime. Greetings, Traveler. This is a dangerous place for the likes of you. How may I be of service? The key to Hecuba's power is the very thing she stole from you, lad. The object that brought you here in the first place, the orb. And that same cursed sphere holds the souls of the necromancers, which Hecuba has channeled to the undead, reanimating legions of unholy warriors. Only once the orb is housed under the staff of oblivion can the weirdling's power be harnessed and those evil souls recaptured. And only then can your return to Earth be assured. Seize the orb! At this dark hour, we have no other hope.
you. Thank <laughs> you. 
my necromancer's blood, I command thee, obliterate him! imminent. Guards, dispose of this nuisance. This time you've crossed the line, puny mortal. <laughs> Pay for this intrusion with your worthless life.
You tried to kill me, but you failed. Perhaps you'd like me to show you how it's done. Woo! You missed. I see you're a failure as a conjurer as well. Huh? What are you doing? Open the door. Let me go! I didn't miss. Stay there. Here. Why don't you keep this? Thank you, lad. A fine trophy of a hard-won battle. I'll treasure it for the rest of my cloud-sailing days. Take me home, Captain. Let's see if we can't find you a plug for this thing. Congratulations, Conjurer. You have defeated Hecuba. But would you have won as a wizard? <laughs>